Hi, my name is James Colcliffe, I'm the Managing Senior Partner of Austin Rice Associates, and I'm joined today in our Shanghai office with William Coppin, one of our partners here at the company. William, um, there's a lot of talk at the moment about structured products and how they may fit within someone's portfolio. Um, how would you explain structured products to a, a new investor? Um, it's a good question. Um, I guess structured products, they, they fall uh, in, in, in the sort of ca- category of maybe a hybrid type investment. Um, generally speaking, they're used to provide some sort of income, um, provide a bit of consistency, um, provide a sort of schedule with defined benefits and risks. So it's nice for an investor who, who's quite methodical, who wants to see what their potential upside is and also know their potential downside. Um, a structured a structured product is is generally going to be based on a basket of between three and five individual equities, so individual companies, or a basket of maybe three to five actual indexes. Um, they vary depending on uh, the the sort of risk profile. So, for example, James, we could have maybe uh, a higher risk product, which would be constructed of five emerging market companies where the 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 payoff or or, or the return would be in the form of quarterly income payments which would annualize at 18 percent we could then have something a lot more conservative which would be based on maybe a couple of sort of defensive indexes where the the income would be on an annual basis and it may be something like six or seven percent so you know depending on what a particular investor is looking for and of course, us and as an advisor, we will advise based on you know risk, time to invest, the sort of expected uh, returns available. We will then come up with either one or more uh, structured investments or options of a portfolio of structured investments that meet the criteria. And just to just to really summarise for for people, just to put it in a nutshell, it's it's just a way to invest money and have defined income uh, paid throughout the course of a year. Okay, so that sounds interesting. So could you maybe give us an example of how some of your existing clients have been able to, to benefit uh, over recent months from those types of investments? Yeah, of course. I mean, uh, we've all seen what's happened in the markets over over the last couple of years. Um, you know, we've had a great 2013, you know, US rallied 30, 40%. And, you know, we've seen some great upside in, in, in certain equity markets. And then on the flip side, we've seen, you know, um, the, the value of, I don't know, commodities dropping. Um, so what, how, how I bring a portfolio of um, existing structured notes to, to the table for a particular client would be, you know, if we look at the typical market cycle of all main asset classes, some will be up, some will be down. If you don't want that uncertainty, then maybe we can look at some, uh, at some structured investments. And of recent times, um, you know, last couple of years, we've, we've probably had... Um, structured investments that are, are returning between 8 and 10% per year in what I would probably call a sort of medium to medium high um, sort of risk um, uh, portfolio. Uh, as a comparison to, say, the markets, this is provided a much more consistent income stream. Okay, so if one of your clients was, was sitting down with you today and asking you to go through current structured products that are available, um, what, uh, what products would you be talking to them about? So again, depending on the risk, um, you know, that would depend on the on the ultimate recommendation. But as of today, for example, uh, we've seen a correction recently in the markets um, and 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 a sort of rally that's um, starting to pick up again. So what what we're quite interested in at the moment are some undervalued opportunities, maybe in Europe, uh, maybe in the emerging markets. Generally, at the moment, we're looking at some individual equity based products which are returning around fifteen uh, percent per year. Uh, so this would be the sort of high risk side of things but certainly a lot of a lot of value so remember these products should pay a consistent income unless certain uh, criteria is met for example the particular markets we invest in drop below maybe 50 percent or, or something like that so at the moment having uh, the opportunity to buy in when the markets have already corrected you can probably see it's a good opportunity now um, so that's on on, on, the, on the sort of higher risk side. On the lower risk side, we've got some some nice sort of conservative uh, conservative options, which are based on indexes. So the same indexes that may have corrected. 
Um, and these are paying around 65 to 7% per year on a semi-annual basis with much less risk because the index uh, index is used as the as this sort of uh, point of, of uh, providing the income. Okay, so if a client wanted to get involved with one of those opportunities, would that be something they'd be able to do through money they're investing on a regular basis, maybe on a monthly basis, or is this from a, a lump sum investment point of view? I mean, typically speaking, this would be a lump sum or single premium investment. So it would be a case of, you know, maybe you've got some money sitting in the bank with, you know, whoever you bank with making half a percent a year in US dollars. We can speak to you about some options and again, varying degrees of risk. One may provide you 4%, one may provide you 10 or 15% per year. And then then you as a client can say, well, okay, I'm prepared to take this amount of risk. I like the idea of say 10% and, you know, I'm happy investing for three to five years. You know, that would be the typical scenario of why we and how we would invest using these. That's great. Thank you very much for your insight into structured products, William. Thank you. Thanks.